All right, welcome back to some more Fallout 3. We're on our way to Rivet City, uh, traveling along the coast. Oh no. Hello? Hey, what's go go You gotta be so mean, like I was just passing by. Oh, wrong thing. Hey, wait. Please hold. Please hold. Oh. Oh my God, this thing sucks. Tough guy. Don't run from me, boy. Don't run from me, boy. Who's the tough guy now? Hey, where you going, boy? <laughs> Don't run. Don't run. Yeah. Fuck you! Come here! Oh my god, this thing's so inaccurate. I'm gonna beat your ass. Come here! Don't hide from me. Oh, in the back of the head. Somehow you're not dead. Listen, I'll give you a chance if you give me the gun on your back. Oh, oh no. okay. You know, I was gonna walk away, but... Guess not. They all die someday. You just chose it sooner. Wow. What a dummy. Psycho. Oh, look, they got a Christmas tree. Wow. Milk carton, yada yada. What is that, shot glass? Oh, yeah, dude, look at this stash. All of it. Oh my god, I'm almost over encumbered. Hold up. Dude, I barely left my house. <laughs> I'm not even halfway there yet. Oh yeah, that's right. I ran into a uh, enclave dude. Literally like two minutes before recording. He had an iBot with him. Oh, dude. Hey, buddy. Nice home you got here. What do you need? Uh... Take a look. Welcome to Godforsaken Hellhole. Not much to look at, but it's all mine. <laughs> oh boy. Really comfortable calling. You're a psychopath. The vault legend. Got some great news out of the town of Megaton. Turns out the live atomic bomb in the town center has finally been deep sixed for good. The town sheriff, one Lucas Sims, commissioned the one, the only lone wanderer from Vault 101 to disarm. Talking about me. Next time you're in the neighborhood, pop into the studio. All three dogs, toasters, been on the fritz. Thanks for listening, children. A pleasure, dude. Let me take a look. When you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, we're Radio Free Wasteland, and we're here for you. And now, some. Bye. <laughs> I'm a legend. Hey, look, there's the Citadel. Wow. Oh, great. Oh, great. Hey, man, I'm just passing by. Hey, I'm just pa- oh, Piece of shit. Stop, I'm just passing. Oh my god, there's more. 
get up close and personal. Ooh. Ooh. Super mutants over there? It's just you? You and your brother? Are you mad? Oh. Oh. Get away. When in doubt, pull the shotgun out. It does magic. Didn't have anything either. Look at him. Oh, shit. What is that guy got on his back? What is that? Oh, no. I... I don't think I should be doing this. I need like a sniper out there. Ah! almost dead. Oh no, he's hiding. He's hiding behind his brother. What are you gonna do? I killed your friend. There's only one of you. You got a sledgehammer? No. Oh, no. Please, no. Please. hiding up here uh, metro station back there Yeah, now all I need to do is repair the missile launcher I have. Okay, I'm gonna grab this landmark. Alright. I don't even know how close we are. Come in peace. All right, you're not peaceful. Ooh. Sir? Please, sir. I just want to pass by. Ah. 
fucking screaming. Oh. Oh no. Oh, they got a person up there. Oh, dude, I barely missed them. Oh, this really sucks. Uh-oh, he dropped his gun. Where did that bullet go? Oh. Sir? I gotta get closer, I can't even, can't even do enough damage. Oh no, you dropped your gun! What a shame! Dude, just die. I ain't getting paid to stay here. Oh, yeah. Come on, give me some more loot. Oh, my God. It's nice. Alright. He's hoping he doesn't come back. much I thought I was dead for sure here I managed to hide these supplies before they tied me up you take them it's the best I can do to thank you now nah, keep them you'd know best wouldn't you I have yeah, to go. I think again thank you see ya oh there she goes off into the wasteland Hoping we make it to Rivet City. Where did this guy go? There's no exit. Where did <laughs> he ran over here? Now he's not here anymore. Oh my God, 34 shot. Oh, there he is. Oh no! Get out of there! He's coming back. I'll protect you. Game over for you. Don't worry, citizen. Don't worry, citizen. Oh my god. Dude, didn't you learn your lesson? 
Didn't you just watch your brother get mowed down? Oh, shit. Oh! Dude, thank God I'm wearing this armor. My head would have been tempted in. Oh, I shouldn't have picked that up. Okay. How close are we now? Oh, my God. Okay, so here's the thing about this, uh, us coming here already. We're gonna skip talking to the doctor, because then that's gonna skip the whole GRE thing and whatnot. Uh, we're gonna go with how the game wants us to go. So we're gonna go to the GRE building and stuff and meet, uh, the lioness girl or whatever her name me? is. I need water. Purified water. Please. Need some water? Here, dude. I mean... Just shut up and take it. Just come on. See ya. Uh. Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait while the bridge extends. Hold it right there. State your business in Rivet City. Uh, uh I'm, I'm here to do some research. Research, huh? I can't help you there. But you're free to ask around inside. Just don't start any trouble. No problem, dude. Uh, do you know anything about Rivet City? I don't exactly have time to worry about the history around here, now do I? I've got oh, okay. to worry about what's happening on it now. Okay, yeah, see ya. Carry on then. Man, here's, here's hoping I know my way around. But I want to go to the market. Hey, yo, can you open up? Alright. I guess while we're here, where's the gun person? Is that hey. this guy? They call me Shrapnel. I run this place. Got the best damn armament you'll ever see. Wow. Man, I love guns. Nothing better than the kick of a 44. Ain't seen many of those around lately. They're tough to come by. Uh. Yeah, what you got? What you looking for? Oh, no. He's not selling it. Who sells it? Tell me, old man, which one of you sells the blueprints? Well, I guess I can sell some stuff to you, so. Pleasure doing bit. <laughs> See you later, chump. Come back soon. We always got a lot of ammo in stock. Oh wait, hand, I have. Don't know you. Don't care. Keep it short. Wow. <laughs> What's your problem, pal? Loosen up. I'm short on time, and your five minutes are up. See ya. Wait, what? Oh, shit. If you want any of this shit, just say so. Otherwise, keep your fingers the hell away from the triggers. I don't want no accidents. Yo, you know anything about history? History? Fuck if I know. Hell, fuck if I care. Okay, note to self. Don't talk Come to you. Come back soon. We always got... No, I won't be coming back. Don't even think you of Hey, you know anything about this place? Stay away from me. What do you want? Are you one of them? What? Have been for years. 
What are you scared of? I suppose it doesn't matter if I tell you. I used to be a slave. I saw a slaver on this ship. His name is Sister. I'm afraid he's after me. Huh. Don't worry, I would never turn in a runaway slave. Really? Oh, thank you. Can you help me? I've been so worried with him around. I can hardly sleep at night. Here, take 25 caps. Thank you. I'll go to Flack and Shrapnel's just before closing. I don't have anything to give you, but I think I can trust you with a secret. Is it if history? If you ever go up north, there is a secret slave hideout called Temple of the Union. You might find them useful. Nice. Yeah, Damn it. Bill's going to have to replace them. Yo, you got information? This here is Flack and Shrapnel's gun shop. Pretty catchy, huh? Take a look around. If you see anything you like, I'll be right over here. Uh... Yeah, aren't you afraid of someone using your guns on you? Here, in Rivet City? I'm packing, and most of the rest of these guys are packing. Not to mention security. Hmm. Uh, you know anything about history? Fred, I can't help you, pal. Been here for years, but all I know about the history is that it's a safe place to settle down. Maybe Bannon can help you out. He sure acts like he knows it all. Bannon? Alright. Need to do some killing, eh? Huh? Wonder if this guy is anything different. It does not look like it is. Nope. No, no, no. See ya. If you need more. Shut up. I'm sure she'll just scrounge something. Who's Bannon? Everything Bannon? looks okay here. Bannon? Get out of my way. Bannon? Welcome to Potomac. Welcome to Potomac Attire. I am Bannon, proprietor and city council member. I carry discriminating attire for discriminating customers. Uh... <laughs> I'm not good enough to shop here. Uh... I have business with you. Straight to the point. I like that. Oh, no. This is not what I meant. Wow. Whole lot of nothing. So you're on the city council. Dr. Lee, Chief Harkness, and I are all on the council. We meet every Monday morning. I can be very influential, if you know what I mean. Far more than Seagrave Holmes. Huh. Think he's a threat to your influence? A threat? No, of course not. Well, maybe. He wants to replace me on the council. He's a shady character. I just can't prove it. Now, if someone were to find something incriminating in his room... Hey, yo, Well, what? let's just say I would be very appreciative. Yo, what? Hmm. Oh, well, hey, you know history? Why, I practically set this whole place up. When I got here 12 years ago, it was just a handful of dead-enders squatting in a rusted-out rowboat. Now I'm on the council, and with my leadership, we're the strongest settlement in the wastes. Of course, a few of those dead-enders still stick around, but who'd want to leave? Uh... Oh, God. I don't have a hundred. Uh, uh... Well, yeah, oh, let's go. it was hardly any place of importance until I arrived on the scene. That's all ancient history now. No one would ever care about it. If you insist on wasting your time on that, you could try that bartending old crone down below, Belle Bonnie. <laughs> Belle Bonnie, all right. See ya. Come back soon. I won't be coming back. Welcome hey, you sell, so, uh... This is a quick fix. I mean, that's the name of our shop. Polly and mine, that is. My name is Cindy. Who the hell Cindy is Polly? Cindy Quintelli. What you got for sale? We've got all kinds of chems. Pheromone. Gosh damn it. Who? Who's selling the damn thing? Oh, hey, it might be over here. Dude, where's half of the people? Yes. Alright, whatever. It doesn't matter. Uh. Okay, we need to make our way down to the bar area. 
church? Nope. Hmm. We might need to go back outside. Bell Bonnie, and this is the Muddy Rudder. I'll tell you what I tell all the fresh meat. Don't start anything down here, or I'll have Brock kick your ass. Are you a Wendigo? I don't like the shine in your eyes. Nice place you have here. You must be drunk. Are you gonna order or what? Wow. Uh, got any history? History? What, not enough shit around here already? You need to dig up more? Don't know if it ever had an official start. It's just been here forever. Stuck in the river and full of assholes. Uh, I, I bet someone like you hears a lot. No, Fuck. but I can damn sure share a bag of get the hell out of my bar. First one's on the house. Now scram. Come on. He organized the entire place. Huh. Why, that lying son of a bitch. He wasn't even born when I got here. Wanna know this tub's history? Only person who really knows it is Pinkerton. And most think he's dead, or gone. He's holed up in the other half of the ship. And he don't like visitors. They'll set you straight. Other half of the ship. I'll be right here when you get thirsty. No, nope, I'm never coming back. Never setting foot in this bar again, because you were so mean to me. Yes? Get on my way, chump. these load times so fast hey hey do you think if I jump off right here will I die oh god hey I'm on holy shit is this place irradiated I can't see. Oh, I thought I was going to die. Dude, why is it so fucking dark? Damn, this place has seen better days. This guy seriously go for all this shit? Hey yo, there's something evil in here. Oh shit. Oh why is he so dumb? Run. Juke him. I run around, you can't find me. Oh god, this is not a safe place to be. Oh! Oh, fuck! Good thing I closed the door. Oh no, I just fucked up. Well, that problem's out of the way. Alright. 
why do I feel like I'm two feet off the ground? Pinkerton? I'm like really scared. I'm trying to be really careful where I step. Pinkerton? Hey, dude. How the hell did you get in here? Hmm. I suppose you can't be all that bad if you made it this far without dying. This is the part where you tell me what the hell you are doing bothering an old man who obviously wants to be left alone. Get on with it already. Uh, I'm here about history. <laughs> what? I have better things to do than yak about those backstabbers up topside. Now get going. Come on, I just, you're the only one that knows the truth. Ha, sounds like you've been poking around all right. I'm surprised any of those reprobates even remember me. Maybe they still laugh about how they edged me out of the council back then. But you can set the record straight. Yeah. For that, you have to go all the way back to when remnants of the Naval Research Institute cleared the Meyer Lurks off this wreck about 40 years ago. We were looking for new lab space. And this bucket of bolts just happened to have a well-preserved science bay on it. Everything else just grew up around that lab once we got it up and running. The science team was led by one H. Pinkerton. Oh, so you used to be in charge. That lasted until about 18 years ago, when those ambitious backbiters like Lee and her little team showed up. She came in with her big purity project pipe dream, and my whole staff started working with her, those traitors. She even took my seat on the council. By then, I was glad to leave it behind. And hell if I'm leaving the city I made great. Hey, I get that. Uh, got any hard evidence? Of course I do. A good scientist always keeps track of their data. Here. They probably don't even remember, but I kept the records of that first council meeting. Take them, if it'll put them in their place. Yeah, maybe. Uh... What are you doing down here? The secret kind. Well, if you must know, I'm an electrician and computer expert. And I'm a bit of a surgeon. Really, the most gifted scientist you'll find. <laughs> And the guy that got Rivet City up and running in the first place. And after all that, Lee and her gang of flunkies pushed me out. Ha! <laughs> Project Purity, indeed. What a bunch of morons. They can't even clean some water. Uh, what are you doing over here? I live here. It's where I do my work. And it's far away from Dr. Lee and all those other monkeys dressed up like scientists. You made it past my defenses, which proves you aren't a dummy. And you haven't killed me. So I suppose you aren't here to do that. I suppose you can hang around if you want. Just don't touch anything. Uh, I'm good. I gotta go. Don't let your guard down. Uh, uh, yeah, you're right. Damn, you got a lot of stuff over here, dude. You know, that book of science is calling my name. What else he's got over here, huh? Dude, where do you sleep? Oh, he's got everything. Look at this. Look at this place. It's amazing. Is this where you sleep? Oh, wow. You got a TV. What's the point of having a TV, like a living room set up if you can't even get TV? Alright, I guess we'll head back to, uh, Myra. So we got all the information we need. Here, buddy, I'll close your door to keep you safe.
Oh, Myra, I'm back. Any luck finding out how Rivet City got started? Yeah, it took me forever to get there. Uh, I got a lot of research done about the place. Uh, talked to some old dude. Uh, talked to some barkeep that was really mean. And, yeah. Aha! Not just as easy as asking around, was it? Good information takes real work to uncover after all. So, tell me all about it. Uh, well, you see, it began as a science station, and traders and settlers settled around it. Huh. I would have figured the science station came afterwards. Well, good to see genius get rewarded. A bit of smarts leads to a big reward, huh? Speaking of which, in thanks, have a few of these. So the next time you've got to be quick on your wits. Oh, and I'll let the Rivet City traders know they'll be favorably mentioned in the book. You'll get a discount buying gear from them in the future. Ooh. Is that it? Are we done? Yep. That's the last bit for the toughest survival guide in the wastes. Survivors of the world, rejoice! And everyone else, too. For all your hard work, I want you to have this mini nuke. A mini -nuke. I kept meaning to use it to dig a well, but honestly, it just makes me nervous. Now, I just need to do a few last tweaks, and it'll be ready to print and distribute. Thanks for all the help. A mini nuke. <sighs> Let me guess, you need me to go print it. So cynical. No, no. I can take care of all that with the few traders I know. What makes you think I'd force you to handle something so dangerous? Now you should just lie back and bask in the praise for helping with the book. Okay. Uh, uh, I'll see you later. I went through a lot of pain for that. It better be worth it. And if it wasn't for that fearless fortitude and sacrifice for science, it wouldn't have been made. It'll be a tremendous boon to humanity, you know? I'll share these with the traders, and soon, everyone will know about the Wasteland Survival Guide. But first, here, the very first copy of our book goes to you. I couldn't have done it without you, my Wasteland Survival Expert. Whoa, wait, what the fuck? How did I not have that achievement? <laughs> I've done this. Oh, wait. This is a different profile. <laughs> it all makes sense now. <laughs> all right. See ya. See ya. See ya. Well, I think it's about time we finally head over to the GRE building or whatever it was called. Right? It's called GRE. GNR. Sorry. Alright. Well, I guess we'll head over there.